John, I was just wondering if there's anything you could say about Russian forces around Ukraine, and if you've seen anything in the last 24, 48, 72 hours that would lead you to believe there's a, a change in their position or posture or intent. Uh, what I would say is we continue to watch uh, and monitor unusual Russian military activity near Ukraine, uh, and we also continue to consult with allies and partners uh, on the issue. I obviously can't speak to Russian intentions, and I'm not going to get into an intelligence assessment uh, uh, of exactly what we're seeing, but, uh, but again, uh, we continue to monitor this closely, and as we've said before, uh, any escalatory or aggressive actions by Russia would be of great concern to the United States. Would you be able to compare in any way now to, to spring or the, the April-May time frame? Yeah, I, I'm going to steer away from comparisons right now. Again, we continue to watch this, uh, 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 these, these movements closely. Um, we, and you've heard the, the chairman speak to this just recently. I mean, well, obviously we're concerned by it. But I think I'm, I'm going to refrain right now from making comparative analysis from the podium. Yeah. David. What is unusual about the Russian military activity? I, I think without getting into um, uh, too great a detail right now, I, I, I think it's, it's really a matter of scale. It's, 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 a, it's a matter of the, the, the size of, uh, of, uh, of the units that we're seeing. Uh, there's been a lot of reporting, some commercial satellite uh, photographs recently showing Russian troop movements near Ukraine. I want to get your thoughts on that. What do you confirm and what do you see there? Uh, well, a couple of things. There's a lot of media reporting out there uh, from various states, uh, you know, Ukraine, uh, it, the media in Ukraine, uh, Poland, other states that border Russia. Uh, and then it's being picked up in Western media. So. What we're seeing is uh, what John Kirby mentioned yesterday. It's a significant amount of military movements uh, on the Russian side of the Ukrainian border. Uh, nothing overtly aggressive, per se. Uh, we've seen this before. Uh, every year they do an annual exercise called Zapad. Uh, last April, the Russians ran a very, very large exercise, somewhere in the tune of about 50,000 troops or so. Uh, so what does this mean? <clears throat> we don't know yet. Too early to tell. Uh, but we're continuing to monitor it with all of our uh, capabilities and and uh, and we'll uh, uh, stay abreast of it.